This is the Voyager H. It eliminates noise, announces the color name. It has a smart sensor technology with a comfortable fit. We are going to do the unboxing and it's stated here it has got 6 hours of uh, usage time, 7 days with a range of 10 meters and it weighs 9 grams. And guess what? It is splash proof. So let us unbox this and take a look. So in the box itself, we have got the car charger, the USB cable as well as some earbuds. And of course we have got some user manual here. And it says before using, first activate your headset. There's a get started guide. And it comes in various languages. And of course we have got the earpiece itself. The Voyager H. So if you have watched my other video, we have done a review for the Plantronics Voyager 3200 series. And you can refer to my video on that. Uh, the Voyager 3200 series, it comes with a charger itself. And guess what? The Voyager H is compatible. You are able to use the charger, the portable charger from the Voyager 3200 series. So that's the first thing that we want to highlight. So let's turn this unit on. So over here is the power button. You can see that it's blinking red and blue, indicating that it is in the pairing mode. So we are going to turn on our mobile phone and get this paired to our mobile phone. From the mobile phone, let's go to the Bluetooth and let's select more settings. As you can see, it has found our Voyager H. So let's select that. And you can see that once it's paired, it's no longer blinking blue and red and the LED has now gone off indicating that it has paired with our mobile phone. So as you can see it is that simple to pair this device to your mobile phone. Next we want to highlight over here this is the charging port and you can charge it using the USB cable that comes with it. Over here, you have got the volume up and volume down. To answer calls, simply tap on this part over here to answer or reject any calls. The mute button is right over here. So it's a fairly simple operation for this Plantronics Voyager H. So let's suppose you need to pair this headset to another device such as a PC or another phone. You will need to get it into a pairing mode. Here's how to get it into pairing mode. First of course you need to turn it on. Once it's on, you need to tap over here. Press and hold until you see that the headset is in pairing mode. There. 